Hey, I'm back. <laughs> Two bots, everybody. Dude, this is so dumb. I'm back. <laughs> Welcome back. Yeah, I'm back. Dude, this is so dumb. I literally was talking about, I think I have the best settings. Okay. I don't know why DC'd. No clue. I'm clueless. Also, I have to run an ad so we don't have pre-rolls. I'll only run a one minute. Clueless. Why did it do that? Okay, let's see. I think there's two VODs. Bruh. Hmm. Okay, I'm checking the log files. It says there's nothing wrong. Yeah, it says there's, like, nothing wrong. It's not the internet either. It's literally fine. Hmm. Peace, I too. Hmm. I think it's because Twitch's issue is that the reconnect period is only a minute. Peace, I too. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to verify that it's synced still. It's synced. Get back to work. No more time off task. No talking room. No talking. Finally. Daisy Cruiser is beaten. Thank God. Finally. Now we'll talk. Other two tracks are easy peasy lemon squeezy. Ago, my 
<laughs> okay. Let's try that again. A couple months ago, my roommates insisted on like feeding the stray cats, and I wasn't different about it. Because, you know, I think it's cute helping provide for the local community, i.e. the cats. But I told them, I was like, if they ever poop in the yard, you have to clean it up. And so, lo and behold, a few weeks later, there was cat poop on the grass. And I told them, and they were like, begrudgingly, they were like, why can't you do it, peace? And I'm like, no, you're the ones who wanted to feed them, so you have to do it. So, I had to like, show them how to pick up cat poop. Like, have they never done it before? Like, huh? Anyway, so after that happened, they decided to no longer feed the cats. But we still have, like, a couple bags of cat food because they bought some. They bought so much. I don't know why. So I myself have decided to start feeding the cats again. And I have yet to see any yet. But it's still, like, really nice waking up and seeing all the food is gone. Because whenever I go on my walks, I usually see a good handful of, like, rabbits and cats around. Even if it's, like, raccoons eating it at night, I don't care. You know, they need food, too. Don't do this to me. Thank god. Holy, out of retro line of blue shell. Oh my god. One more track, and then I will finally get the three star. Finally. Hi, go Wobo. Yes, I'm back. First lap done. I don't understand why so many people have such a disdain for the poor or homeless. I think it comes from the feeling of wanting to be better than somebody else, like there's such a general lack of class consciousness here in the states and I know there's not much that individuals can do to help those people who need it, like that should be the government's responsibility, but I personally still believe that one person doing something positive for somebody who needs it can leave a lasting impression. So what I usually try to do is I usually, I carry like a little bit of cash whenever I go out, you know. There's been times where um, <laughs> I'll forget my cards, I only really have cash. Like if I see somebody on a corner like begging, I will give them like a 10 or a 20 if I have it. Like even if it's my own grocery money, I don't care. Because in my opinion, that'll be food for them. And a lot of instances, it's very difficult for people who are homeless or at risk at homelessness to find work. Like if you don't have regular access to housing, um, like shelter, food, a clean shower, how are you going to be able to hold a job? And also a lot of employers require a permanent living address. So it's very hard to get out of it once you be fall into it. Like, I know I can't necessarily, like, give everybody housing. I know I'm, at one point, is probably gonna be at risk, because I'm disabled. But, I got two stars? Fuck! Oh my god, I wasn't paying attention! Anyway. I don't like when people will say, like, oh, people who are begging are doing nothing to improve themselves. It's not necessarily that, it's just, it's very difficult to get out of it once you're in it. 
Okay, I'm doing Burno. I gotta do that fucking free again. I forgot what was the track I even failed at. I got first and... Did I fail at squeaky clean? Anyway. I'm not saying that you should... Give money to people. Obviously, prioritize your own well-being if you need to. Ultimately, you cannot, like... You got pipped at the line on Squeaky? Really? <laughs> Somebody clip it. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Like, ultimately, it should be the government's responsibility to take care of the people. But still, like, individual influence can do a lot. Hi, Geo! Welcome in! Can we get some yo's? Hello! Because there's been a few times where, like, I've been out with friends and I will give somebody who's begging, like, a 10 or a 20, and my friend will be like, why did you do that? I'm like, well, I wanted to. And let's be honest, that could be me one day. Like, if my benefits don't get approved, I could be fucked. Mine's are horrible today. It's my controller, I swear. I shouldn't have waited. Didn't they approve you? Well, it's partial benefits, like... Um... I'm not approved for full disability? That'll take a bit. And it's, it's very hard to get approved for disability if you're a younger person. Because the way that SSI works is there's two different branches of it. There is need-based, so if they determine that you're, like, severely or moderately handicapped, then you're eligible. Or it's based off of work credits. So the longer you've been in the workforce, the more you've paid into social um, security. I fucked up. Yes, full disability will give me more money. I think the maximum that one can get from SSI is like... It's like 1300 or something? So it's still poverty wages that they're giving people. But it's better than nothing, which is not how it should be, but you know. I'm gonna stick with Berto. She's my queen. Dude, I hate this. What if I literally cannot end stream until I beat this? Fuck! This was not the plan for today. This was not the plan. <laughs> they want the disabled people to struggle? Bro, you, you don't even know the half of it. It's... I won't talk about it. <laughs> And there's, like, also a lot of legislation in place where, like, if you are disabled, um, Child Protective Services can take away your child. Um, there was another one. They can take away your assets. Hey, there's a lot of fucked up shit. God, please! I think the reason why they don't give more money to disabled people is because they don't produce capital. Like, if we were no longer a capitalist society, then it wouldn't matter if somebody was unable to work or contribute to traditional or the capitalist system. Why would they take assets? I'll have to look into it again. Wait, I think I, think I said it wrong. Wait. It, okay, it's not that they would take away assets, Is Okay, I meant to say that they would take away your benefits if you have a certain amount of assets. That's what I meant to say, I think. I'm tired, I got the vaccine yesterday. <laughs> I, I know they can take away your children, I know that. 
because the reason why they would be able to take away your children is they could deem you physically or mentally unable to provide for your child. But they would only really do that in extreme circumstances. Or if they just really didn't like you. Another way that it's not necessarily the government could take away your assets is just since you would not be able to have assets in your name because assets is capital, right? You can only have X amount of capital in your name. Um, you would have to put all your assets into like a family or your spouse's name. That's the main gripe. Okay, no talking. Let's talk about something more fun. I can never do that turn. <laughs> Today's the first day of class and you're doing cringe introductions? I'm literally so DOM! Oh my god, sorry. You know, I kind of miss those days. The days in class where you like literally do nothing. Like the first week and last week of school, I swear were the best. Cause that's when you get to like actually kn know and learn a bit more about like the kids in your class. It is cringe, but it is kind of fun. If you're more extroverted, like I definitely think past me was like, oh, this is so cringe. But present me is like, oh, that sounds kind of fun. The teacher wants a photo of you? Holy moly! <laughs> Make sure it's a cute one. Maybe you can, like, riz other people up. <laughs> okay, easy. Two first plays. No, the only pictures that I was required to, like, post for my online college was, like, my PFP, because you had to have a picture of yourself for your PFP. I'm gonna put no photo and say, oops, I forgot! <laughs> I mean, do you not have, like, a PFP? <laughs> Automatic F. Yeah, don't risk it. This is the big leagues we're talking about. Or you should- you should post like an AI generated picture. <laughs> you don't have PFPs but they want you to post a picture in your post. Okay, okay. Another banger strat is you know how on websites whenever the picture doesn't load it has like a loading icon or a question mark icon? All you need to do is screenshot that image and upload that. That way if anybody clicks on it, they'll be like, oh, the image is just loading. Weird. Not saying that I've done this, I would never. <laughs> what the fuck? No, it's a good strat. Trust me. I'm throwing. I'm too scared, but it's so smart. I'm telling you. Fuck me, oh my god. I cannot lose here. 
Dude, first place is so far ahead. Bro, chill! Thank god. Hey! Also, guys, <laughs> peace in giving evil advice. Sometimes I gotta do it, guys. Even if it's 20 minutes uptime, it's a lie. I've been live since 11. So, it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99. Just kidding. It is September, so all new tier ones are up to. 20% off, I think? Also, gifted subs are 25% off, so Oilers, today's the day. You can also link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for me with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a discount or a Prime available. Get some water, get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Get back to work. I love my job. Okay, one more race, and I will finally get a three-star. If I lose on this attempt, I'm, I'm gonna actually cry. I'm not even kidding. Squeaky clean sprint. I keep getting asked for blooming cat food. Did they hear me talking about cat food? Uh oh. <laughs> no, how they track ads is like so creepy. Like, I understand why companies do it, but then it just feels weird. Like, there's been so many times where like I'll talk about something in a text or in a phone call, and I literally will get ads of whatever I was talking about like the next day. And I don't know how to make it stop. But then sometimes I'm like, ooh, that art supply looks really nice. I was just thinking that I wanted new watercolors. And I personally, I don't use any- <gasps> Personally, I don't use any ad block on my computer. I know I- Not saying I should, because I would never. But I'm just like, why not let people get the bag? I don't know. But then when I say let people get the bag, it's the corporation. So it's like, we hate big corporate. Dude, I look away for one second. I swear to God. Oh, okay. Kind of good that I fell behind. How does she have so many shells? If I lose here... Finally. Three star go trophy. And one of the new DLC pre's. Oh my god, that took an hour. <laughs> yeah, on any video watching platform, because I primarily watch Twitch and YouTube, I pay for the premium the premium memberships to have no ads. Like, the only time I see ads anymore is if I'm not logged in or if I see, like, a visual ad on a website. Otherwise, it's not that bad. Finally! Three stars! On to the next pre. I have zero stars? Oh my god, oh no! How do I have zero stars? Okie dokie! 
Oh, I don't like this pre. This one's dumb. But I'll try my best. For half of my life, I pronounced the X in pre. Okay, we all do that. And if you didn't, you're lying. I remember there was one time in first grade, because I was in like the accelerated learning group within the class. So I remember whenever we had a new list of spelling words, our teacher would pull aside like all the accelerated kids and have us like say all the words, like for the first time. And the word was island. And I pronounced it Island so confidently. <laughs> and little first year or first grade me was arguing with the other kids that Island was the correct way and not island. And I <laughs> I don't remember, but I bet my teacher was giggling <laughs> because I was such a little debate lord back then. Even in first grade, oh my god. And when the teacher told us the correct way to say island, I was so embarrassed. And I have no clue how I didn't know that island was the correct way. Like, my mom, we would go to Hawaii all the time to see family. So I was like, how did I not know how to say island? Like, was I saying, we're gonna go to the Hawaiian Islands, mom? Dude, I was so silly. Okay, but why do silent words exist? I don't know. I don't know. I think we made English hard just to make like people's lives horrible. Also, thank you for the follow. Plus one, everybody. Thank you. Can we get some yo's? Hello. Already got two followers today. Wow. Wow. Wait, wasn't that... Isn't that like an Owen Wilson meme? On. Since I've studied graphic design, I see elements of design everywhere in my day to day. And I think one of the nicest trends I've seen is re restaurant menus. Because you know how a traditional menu is just like a centered bulleted list of the item name and maybe a short description? I've been seeing a lot more menus, especially of like corporate restaurants that have like beautifully laid out almost magazine-esque spread pages within the menus and it literally looks like a pinterest page and it's so nice because one of my biggest gripes in like a recipe book or menus when they don't show pictures of everything because i like to see what i'm eating fuck me oh my god i'm resetting you must be going to fancy restaurants. No. No, I'm not. Oh, 
god, I have to reset. Yeah, I wanna quit. God, end me. Because the IHOP menu, I went there, I think, two weeks ago. The menu is literally beautiful. <laughs> Like, as a designer, I was looking through it like, oh my god, these pictures, the way it's spread out, the layout, holy moly. I was impressed. Reset, let's go again. I haven't been to IHOP in ages. It's actually pretty good. <laughs> the only time I've had IHOP before was through delivery. I haven't had a sit, like, I've never sat down and ate in, in a long ass time. But the menus go crazy. Because you know what they say? You eat with your eyes first. You can get an IHOP of all places delivers? Shut up! You know, I like diner food, and my parents hated it, so they never made it at home. My dad would only make pancakes, like, once in a blue moon. It's- I think it's because, like, my dad used to work at a diner, so he just got, like, sick of making eggs all the time. Which is valid. You know, I don't like making sandwiches, because I worked at Subway for years. But I like diner food. It's like my comfort food. I don't know why. Like a good biscuits and gravy? Holy! Black Bear Diner is also pretty good. <laughs> I don't know if Black Bear Diner is a national chain, but I know there's a few locations in Washington. Are there no local diners? Not really. There's not many here in Washington. Like, I obviously can't leak the names. But back near my parents' house, there was this one really good one. <laughs> but they were like overpriced as fuck. And I remember like, my favorite- OH MY GOD! My favorite local diner, I remember I was reading the Google Play reviews one day, and one of the reviews said they were like a former worker. And they said, like, half the food they made was, like, just microwave. Then I never went there again. Easy peasy. Frozen to microwave can be really good nowadays, though. I don't think so. It could have been just like my- maybe my parents' microwave was broken. Because <laughs> nothing would heat up properly at my parents' house. But now that we're in a new place, this microwave looks, works pretty good for the most part. But everything is always like really soggy. Like, I personally like the soggy texture, but not everybody else does. Like, I think the only thing that comes out good in the microwave are Hot Pockets. And it's only if you use the little cardboard sleeve. Lean Cuisine slaps. Lean Cuisine is way too expensive, like, per serving. It, it's out of my budget. Oh, I think it's too late for me. Dude, how did first get a star? That's so dumb. Oh wait, were they not in first? Were they in last? <laughs> oh yeah, pizza rolls are also good. Easy! 
crazy. Microwave nachos go crazy? Yeah. My parents used to make that all the time. But they would never put enough cheese. So it would only be like cheese on like the top four chips and then the rest would just be plain. But tortilla chips and cheese is like the brokey snack. Even though this is like 200cc, this feels like it's taking all day. And it's been an hour and a half. Ooh. surprises me. This is the only part I don't have memorized yet. Um, guys, clip the stream. We need more clips. Clippers, get on it. So many red shells. <laughs> Jeez. If you clip the stream and you make the best and most, you get a VIP and a gift card. Coke's one last month. Anybody want to VIP him or un-VIP him? <laughs> Thank you. Hi, Mac. Welcome in. Can we get some yo's? I made it home from school. Yay! You lived! No! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy thank fuck. I almost threw. Oh my god. I don't usually throw. said stream elements talks so much yeah I think <laughs> you know if nobody's chatting then there needs to be like at least one active user you know so I don't feel alone <laughs> that's so stupid <laughs> also another reason why I have my elements box fairly active is so that people who are new see that there are like bots enabled in the chat so they don't like act up Okay, if I get first, I am stream. Does elements spam if there's no messages? Yeah, because I have like timed messages. I think I have timed messages for follow reminder, sub reminder, um, clip reminder, and then I used to have socials, but I disabled it temporarily because most of you guys follow offliners anyway. Offline socials anyway. I don't use stream elements for moderation though, like the bot is a bit too aggro in my opinion. I like the Twitch integrated mod functions a lot more. I tried to use chat arena once, but it was like way too complex for me. Big sad. Okay, not bad.
no. Thank you. Oh my god, the end was right there. Oh my god, that was way too close. Finally, I now have retained my title as three-star gold trophy holder of every single 200cc pre. Pretty impressive if you ask me. And two tries, not too bad. Not too shabby. You guys know the rules. I do online. If I get first, chat gets a gifted sub. <laughs> Wait, you want to see some? Okay, my rank was like 7,400. When I played with my sister, I lost like 200 points. Because since I was like a, a higher rank in a low rank lobby, anytime I lost, I lost so much more points. It was so bad. Ooh, I'm in. Let's do a prediction for the fans. Now, I'm still recovering from a vaccine. I'm kind of tired. Oh, dude, I typed place instead of today. Let's do five minutes on the prediction. Everybody, go Gamba. Do you think I will get a first place at all today? Last time, I think I got two in an hour and a half. Stream ends when I get first. Ooh, the purple haired me was cute. Hi, Chip. Welcome in. Can we get some yos? Hi, hon. Man, there's so many SJW me's in this lobby. <laughs> we got two blue-haired people and one purple. Holy. <laughs> okay, I know everybody was clowning on, like, the colored hair SJW, like, clips, like, a year ago. Or no, like, four-ish years ago. But everybody has colored hair now. Like, literally everybody. It's not just a lib thing. Oh, this feels so slow. I'll come back! Don't worry. I wish 200 came up more often in normal online. Oh, what's your rank, Tanuki? Because I'm a little over 7,000 and I get 200cc maybe like once or twice in like a two hour session. Like, does it gradually increase? Like, the rate in which you get- Ooh! The rate in which you get 200, the higher ranked you are. I hope it does. Because usually whenever I- I <laughs> Whenever I do get 200cc randomly when I'm playing online, I tend to do better. <laughs> I love Mario Kart! Just over 11,000? Okay. You know, based on how you play, we would think you'd have like a million points. But I'm still in 10. <laughs> Cause 
Because isn't the most like 99,000? I'll get there one day, surely. <laughs> Says me in 11th Belaze. Oh, you just usually play tournaments? Oh, okay. Got it, boss. Anybody think I can get first? Type one. Wait, hold. Oh. Well, if it was such a hack, they should disable it. I know it's good, but it's too good. <laughs> Two, thank you, Geo. Big fan. <laughs> Sunshine so Airport. Literally, if we get this track 200 CC, I will win. No joke. There's different colored cows at the start of the level. To the left, there's like a brown and a black cow. I literally have never seen them. Chocolate milk cows, see you got it. That's exactly what they're for. <laughs> okay, look on the left, look on the left. Yeah, there's a black cow. Easy first place? Ain't no way. And a boombox? No way I lose here. Nice cow dodge, thank you. My favorite part about the inside drift bikes is that I can easily dodge or change direction. That, that's why I cannot do carts. It's because I'm so used to like the rapid movements. <laughs> nice try, Bozo. Oh my god, look at my lead, holy fuck! I absolutely crushed! Oh my god! That was like the best race in peace in 17 history. I held first for almost like, I think a little over two laps. Oh my god. Holy moly. You're crazy, crazy good. First and all today? Uh, yes sir! Second race, holy shit. You know what that means? Chat gets a gifted sub. First non-sub to type in chat gets a sub. First non-sub. <clears throat> holy. I feel good. Yo, ayo. Hey, Look at me. Mm. Oh, gifted subs are now discounted, guys. 25% off. Wow. Eh, 
enjoy! Have fun with the emotes, Tanuki. Also, no more cat food ads for you. Man, I feel so good! Let's do another prediction. First place again? Guys, go Gamba. Bro, my sub just expired. Big L. Welcome in, Katie. Can we get some yos? Hi. Don't worry, gifted subs are discounted, so maybe you'll get lucky, or there's September discounts. You can get up to 25% off, I think. Fuck! Oh my god, I cannot throw. I literally just got a first! Come on! I will not take this slander. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I gotta like another hour. I can do this. From first to twelfth and a finger snap? Yeah, it's like magic. I cannot. Okay, I'm back in. Bozo. Oh, does anybody have suggestions for what we should do for Saturday's subathon? In terms of, like, just chatting esque activities? What do you guys want to see? Second bubble. Surely I'll get first. <laughs> I want somebody to make a compilation of every single time I've gotten first. That's what I need. Because we all know the compilation of me getting dead last will be longer than the first place comp. Can you finish writing the dictionary? <laughs> okay. Yeah, we can, we can continue that. Yeah. I'll put that on the grab bag for Saturday. I just, I just have to find the journal. I think I lost the- oh! I think I lost the journal it was in. I've said the F word too many times today. I'm sorry. Yoshi's so sad, he's crying. Call Yoshi, he's crying. Damn, I can't. <clears throat> Every time you curse, you gift the sub for the subathon? No, I can't. That'd be too many. Literally, if I get Animal Crossing, I will get first. Whenever it's in budget, I will do another cursing stream. Or no cursing stream. <laughs> Imagine I do a stream where I just say curse words. <laughs> Find Aurora. I was debating if I wanted to play Animal Crossing again for stream. But we'll do it... Um, never. I will play Animal Crossing again once I get partner, and then we'll delete the island again. Dude, fuck this track. Surely I'll win. Do we really have no believers in the prediction? 
You guys are so mean. I literally got a first in the race before this one. I was literally just gonna say, as long as I don't get shoved off on that first section, I can win. It's that first line that always messes me up. Like, I've mastered the actual line, but if there's too many players on the field, it's a lot more risky. Easy. Comeback time. <laughs> Clippers? First place and another boombox? This is looking vaguely familiar. Hmm. Imagine I win. Stay away. Oh my god! <laughs> there was no- there was literally no alert for that one. It's only lap two. Oh my god. We have two bananas. Full protection. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how I can best this guy. I just have to hope there's like a lightning bolt. Or maybe throw it ahead. Ooh, blue shell. I was like, I was too in the moment. I couldn't handle the pressure. Literally, if I get DK jungle, I will get first. <clears throat> you realize I can just keep streaming until I get another first. The prediction says per first place again today at all. So I can literally stream for 12 hours until I get it. I could literally rig the prediction. Nah, but let's be real. Um, 1.47 of time. I'll probably stream for a 2.30 today. Or 2 hours and 30 minutes. I need to rest a bit more. <laughs> Take your time! I think I have a new emote. It's called Howdy. <laughs> Howdy. <laughs> Ain't it cute? I saw it in Hassan's chat the other day. Ew, Wario Stadium. The bank keeps calling me up to compliment me. They keep saying I have an outstanding balance. <laughs> you know, I wish my neurologist would tell me that. My balance has been fucked for years. Anyway, hi, Aslan. <laughs> Anytime Aslan comes to the chat, he always uses the channel voice. <laughs> you know, I will always say hi to you, hun. <laughs> but I hope you're doing well. The thing you do like about mobile banking is that I literally have no need to call my bank anymore. It's so nice. How am I doing? I'm doing good. I've gotten one win in Mario Kart so far, and I finally got three stars in 200cc 
of the new DLC, so I'm feeling great. I'm in 11th place. I feel horrible now. <laughs> this feels more like 200, but I know it's not. Dude, this line used to trip me up for the longest time, but now I'm a pro. Hold third? There's been no blue shells this race either. Wiggler needs to be stopped. Worst item. Oh. <laughs> that is the blue shell. Oh, I literally say I'm the best at this line and I fall off twice. Guys, should I go pro type one? So happy, sixth place. Wow. And two. <laughs> Come on, you gotta humor me a little bit. You were catching up so well. Yeah, I had third, and then I threw. So, um, how are you guys today? We all saw you in the tournament? What does that mean? Are you saying that I'm good or are you saying that I'm bad? I don't like drama. Are you trying to farm drama? Me and the homies hate drama. If you're bad at being bad, are you still bad? Yeah. Dude, I hate those tongue twisters. They make my brain hurt. Drama gets the clicks? Yes, it does. I'll look at some of my more popular clips that I repost, and it's always the clips of me like saying the wildest things, or out of context, me talking about something. Because, I'll be honest, I do clickbait a little bit with my titles, because I know that's what gets people to actually watch it. But a lot of my more popular clips are me like complaining about things, or like giving a negative opinion on something. And I feel like that's gonna bite me in the ass one day. Like, I don't wanna be a drama farmer. Granted, I don't like intentionally. I'm not, I don't call people out. I'm not like me. <laughs> Good start. Yeah, I'm in ninth. <laughs> Are you watching on mobile? But we love drama farming. Farm drama right now if you love it so much. Give your hottest take. Do it. Kind of how it is these days people like watching drama i don't 
actually wonder if like reality TV like fueled that fire. Cause just in general, like people are just gossipy, you know? Like I feel like that's part of human nature, also to like point out the negativity and things just as like a survival instinct. But if you're actively seeking out drama content that is like like hurting people, like on an emotional level, I think you need to do some self-evaluation. You know, focus on yourself a bit more. You don't need to get involved or feel like you need to get involved in their, other people's personal issues, especially online. Like, honestly, get a life! <laughs> trees are awesome. I hate that. I hate trees. Trees are the devil. <laughs> It's the same as when you see a car crash, there's something inside, you just want to watch it. Ah, uh, I've gotten kind of over that mental hurdle. Like, I understand. Because when, when, okay, let's say I'm walking and I see like an accident or I see like a police presence. I don't look, I don't film, I walk away. Because, um, there was one time I witnessed a motorcycle accident. They didn't hit anybody, they just like fell. Like they hit a pothole and then they like fell, like the bike fell on them. Like I still walked up to them and made sure they were like okay. But in my opinion, if I see a situation where like paramedics is already there, I'm not gonna watch, I'm not gonna waste my time like staring. Because then you're just congesting the area. Like you're potentially making it harder for like more EMT to arrive or other police to arrive to the scene. Um. Obviously, like, I don't drive, <laughs> so I'm not, like, in control of the wheel, but, like, if I'm walking by something, I will avoid it. Because I can only assume, like, if you're involved in an accident, it's gotta be embarrassing if people, like, are looking at you. And there's also, like, that little underlying, um... What's it called? It's when bystanders don't do shit. Um... That's why, like, if you're ever in an emergency situation, if there's, like, a group of people around you, specifically call out one person. Like, let's say you're getting harassed in public in a crowd. Um, turn to look at somebody, make eye contact, and be like, hey, you in the red hat, I need your help. You know, like, don't just scream out help if there's a group of people. Like, you have to be specific. Because usually if there's a collective group, not many people will take action. Because a lot of people have the assumption that, oh, somebody else will take initiative. It's called being useless. <laughs> Stop. I'd rather just watch Cop this TV show. No, that show is propaganda, a cab. Dude, how am I only in ten? When everybody thinks someone else will do something, nobody will do something. Exactly. Like, I thankfully have not been in a, in a situation to where, like, I've had to intervene. But I do get worried of the time in which it does that I won't take action, you know what I mean? Because I know I have my own personal anxieties and doubts, but if it comes to someone's safety, like, I genuinely hope I would have the courage in the moment. Wait, I'm in third? Oh! Rigged. I think I've missed like three mystery boxes on this race. What are the odds? That's cute. One day I'll have resourceful things in my tote. Oh, that's so cute. I usually carry a, a mini first aid kit and like band-aids. Because there's been a good handful of times where like a little kid will want a band-aid. Because going back to what we were talking about earlier, like if you're kind of one person, even if it's not like huge on the big in the big picture, you're still hoping that one person feel better. Yeah. Good job, Mac, for stepping up. You know, we need leaders.
you know what else we need um subscriptions because guys we are two hours in the stream the uptime is wrong the stream crashed so it is time for me to run an ad if you want to avoid said ad all you must do is subscribe you can use your September discount with up to 25 percent off or sub for free with prime click subscribe see if you have a discount or a prime sub available if you're new here follow get some water get a snack imagine i get first <laughs> get food dodge <laughs> i do feel bad running ads but you know it's part of the job i do wonder what would happen if i just chose to not run ads twitch app if you're watching this is a hypothetical i would obviously keep running ads i love running ads it's just i feel like it, it does take away from the viewer experience i do understand that like ads are an essential part of the platform it has to be in order to make money i guess but still feels bad god i knew that was gonna happen but that's why like i encourage my regulars my oilers to gift subs to chatters and you know i do my good share of gifting chat a good handful of subs every once in a while that's why like i try to disable pre-rolls whenever i can i personally run three minutes every hour that way no pre-rolls run for an hour straight and then also it's like a longer ad break so people can use the restroom or get some water or i can do the same as well wait i'm in fourth wow Third, okay. Doubters in their boots shaking. Film there. Oh my god, oh my god. First place. Don't. This is so evil. good race like it was back and forth the whole time damn i mean props to the guy who actually got first they were fighting for their lives Dang. believers i'll get first don't worry don't you worry I think I'll stream for like another 30-ish minutes. I'm getting tired. It's also really cold in here. <laughs> I made the mistake of wearing shorts. I'm weird. Whenever I wear clothes, I either have to wear like a short top long pants or long top short bottoms. Because otherwise I overheat. I also can't do jeans anymore. Jeans is too heavy.
<laughs> no items. Imagine. I do wonder if anybody watches me for gameplay. Because I've noticed on my main YouTube channel, usually the gaming videos do better than the just chatting. Which makes sense because I don't have too big a presence on the platform yet. And whenever you watch like a gaming video, if you're in like the fandom already, you already know like the basic how the game works. <laughs> but I still like to think to myself. Like, Rando's watching the stream just browsing Mario Kart and watching me play so bad is funny. I know we've had, like, a few people find me that way, but it's like, how many people, like, actually watch for that reason? I like to think people, um, like me for me, you know? Stop, some bozo keeps putting bananas in the double item boxes. That was D.U.M. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> See, shit like that I do all the time. And it's also, like, not very often where I get mad playing a game. Because primarily I play games for escapism. Like, I don't play to be good. I'm not grinding for pro in any meaning of the word. I- I- <laughs> I just want to have fun. And it's not that I don't take it seriously, I just don't take it too serious. I enjoy you enjoying the game and not taking it seriously. Exactly. We're here to have fun, right? Smile. Because I bet y'all have played a game or been in a lobby where somebody takes it way too seriously. And it's like... Bro, it's a game. I think the only game that I kind of do get frustrated with is Overcooked. I've played it with my roommates and my sister a few times. And if you don't know what Overcooked is, it's like a multiplayer um, cooking game. And you basically have to like delegate tasks within the kitchen and there's different levels, different puzzles. And I get so mad playing sometimes because in my head, Overcooked is like work. So it's really frustrating if my sister and my roommate don't listen to my instruction. If you like chill games, have you tried Yoku's Island Express? No, but I will look it up right now. Um, in order to do multiplayer for Overcooked, you ha I have to like friend people. And I don't friend my viewers, that's cringe. We'll figure out a way to do it for stream. I'll do a whole standalone stream for it. Um, Yoku's... What is it? What is it? Oh, Sydney. Rated 10 out of 10? Huh? Huh? <laughs> that like never happens. 10 out of 10 Steam rating. Wow. I'll look into it later. Thank you for the suggestion, Tanuki. And before anybody asks, I will never play Minecraft on stream. I will not play it for the subathon either. Even though it would give me lots of clicks. I refuse. I've talked too much shit on the Minecraft community. And if I ever played, they would burn me at the stake. This has to be the best music in Mario Kart, hands down. I will not be playing Roblox either because I don't want literal five-year-olds watching. They would not be funny at all. 
<laughs> they would be like, Sally asked me out on the playground yesterday. I don't know what to do. No, I had a third. Oh my god, oh my god. Second, okay. <gasps> no, okay, it's fine. I thought I took away my red shell. Now, first place is no protection. It is downpouring right now. Y'all can't hear it, but it is raining cats and dogs. Get him! <laughs> Lucia. close one. I think it's the same guy. Yeah. It's been raining non-stop since Friday here. I haven't seen the sun in so long. Make sure you're taking your vitamin D gummies. Oh, it's a different guy. I'm getting like today I'm either doing really bad or I'm doing pretty good. I wanna hear the rain. Oh just put up a little rain ASMR video on YouTube. This is the same thing. You get the sound without the cold. I'll do two more races after this one, unless I get first, which I will, obviously. Have you ever played VR? I have not. I have been offered. Like, a few of my friends have, like, a little PlayStation VR headset. And I think one of my roommates has one. I just- I don't want to try it. I know it would make me queasy. And I haven't thrown up for, I think, 10 years. And I want to keep that winning streak. I definitely see the appeal to- <laughs> I definitely see the appeal to VR games, though. But, you know, whenever I play a game, I play for escapism. I don't want to live or play in a VR world. I think I would gain too connected to it. Oh my god, it is so loud, the rain. Guys, if the internet goes out, that's why. Fucker, stream snipe me. It sounds like I'm inside a rock tumbler. It's so loud. Hold, fifth place. <laughs> oh, wow. Everybody hold, this is gonna be the best marker gameplay you'll see in your life.
Besides that. I hate this game. If I would have, because I got bolted on there, so if I would have like lined up my item box better, I could have, I could have held. I could have held. Two more. God damn. It's always like within grasp. I can see it, I can taste it. But it will never be mine. I wonder if anybody's Marikot username is like their NFT. <laughs> hmm. Like 200. Everything feels like 200 today. There are some times when I go through my day and I genuinely feel like my vision is at a lower frame rate than it is supposed to be. Maybe I'm just crazy. I don't know. Because what is normal for me, um, I'm gonna get it tested at some point. Because my big brainness causes neurological issues, so issues with my nervous system. So there will be times throughout the day when I have like jittery vision. I haven't had it for a few days, but it'll, it'll make it look like. Imagine if you dart your eyes like back and forth really quickly. That's what it looks like. But there's also times where it feels like I'm in like 40th FPS. I don't know, it's weird. Fuck me! Oh my god! Welcome to chat! Welcome in! Can we get some yo's? Hi, Kara! Um, if you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Welcome in. I love Mario Kart. Robbed him of eighth. 
or seventh. One more race, one more chance for the believers. Oh, to think I'm the highest ranked in this lobby. Wow. Oh my god, I remember you. Don't leak anything, Clara, but I remember you. Hi. Hi, hun. Welcome in. I see your Instagram sometimes. Welcome in. Guys, do not interrogate Clara. Okay? But hi, Clara. Welcome in. I see your art sometimes. Welcome in. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Welcome in. Feel free to chat, lurk, whatever makes you happy. Um, we used to be in art class together. How <laughs> are you, Galera? Guys, don't be weird. <laughs> Hello, Mal? Question <laughs> mark. Um, what else do you play? Um, I do variety, primarily Mario Kart. Um, right now we're doing Spirit Fair, which is like a spirit, a spirit, a story game. But yeah, it's been chill. I make little YouTube videos because I'm sad. <laughs> I can't. Okay, last race, Baby Park, of course. Yeah, DM me on Instagram later. We'll catch up. Guys, last chance. If I get first, I end stream. If I don't, I end stream. ever get good at Mario or <laughs> I will get good at Mario Kart. I don't think I'll ever be good at Baby Park. It's it's pure RNG. It's so dumb. Just erase one of the ones that I'm in first place. Up. Okay, I kind of want to do one more race because Baby Park is rigged. I promise I'm good. I've gotten one first place today, guys, and like. A million seconds. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay. So Ralph and Sander usually get first from what we've seen today, and they got seventh and eighth. I'll do one more. One more for the fans. Oh, these all suck. I'm decent at Yoshi Valley. If I get Yoshi Valley, I will get first. I can't let the believers lose. <laughs> Don't win, I wanna keep my channel points? No! I will always defend my ride or die believers. Peace was a cool kid. No, I'm not doing high school lore. We'll do that during the Dear Diary stream. No, I was a little scrub. <laughs> this track. We didn't get DK Jungle at all today. Okay, last race. I'm not even kidding. Just one more hit. Did you have a journal in high school? I did. <laughs> I did have a little diary, but I was more into write. I was more into journaling when I was in middle school. 
I kind of slowed down in high school. And I've gone back and read some of my diary entries, and a lot of the entries are literally just me writing down, like, social interactions I have with friends. And apparently that's, like... <laughs> that's, like, a, a neurodivergent thing. <laughs> Do you still have it? Yeah. Oh my god, insane skip! I do still have my diaries. If we hit 2 million subs, I will read it on stream. No joke. Time to take out a loan. How, how, that would be like 10 million dollars. But during September's 25% off, that would be... How much? 10 million divided by 4. I don't know. That's too much math. That would be about like 7... 7 million. Wait, I'm in third? No way. Yeah, only six milli. God! You. I got fourth. I'll take it. Guys. Did I get first again today? No. But you know what? I got first on the second race, which is really good. That is the second best stream ends when I get first run. If someone went broke or in debt donating to a streamer, that'd be sad. I mean, it's happened. There's, I've seen like mini docs about it happening to people. Cause like, I, I think those instances that are either characterized by like obsession or generosity, you could say. Guys, Oilers go crazy, but not too crazy, okay? You gotta support little kids. Well. I think I'm going to wrap it up here for today. I need to rest. My vaccine is making me tired. Guys, get vaccinated. They have the flu vaccine, which you should get by the end of October. And the new COVID boosters are out. So get them if they're available in your area. And if you have concerns, always talk to your doctor. Vaccines are good. Okay. Oh, it was really dark in my room. I will get some music on and we'll do calligraphy. Guys, if you want me to write your name, all you need to do is use your channel points and I will write your name for free. While I'm getting that set up, gentle reminder, check out my YouTube channel. We have weekly stream highlights and daily clips on the YouTube. Wait, we have daily YouTube shorts on the clips page. And I am doing a subathon on this Saturday. So everybody. You better be there, or you're a square. Thank you for redeeming, Cole Bobo. I appreciate it. Any other redeemers? Dude, I'm like ready to fall asleep. I didn't think I'd be this tired today. Let's do this music. Random color? Okay. <laughs> Notice I didn't inflict a rainbow on you again. I appreciate it.
I might have to turn on the overhead light for the camera. Yeah, it's really dark. Yep. Let's see, we had P three people redeem. Peach. I don't often do gray. Thank you for redeeming, Mac. Oh, come on, I can never make your fucking name fit. I'll do it one day. One day. Yeah, because gay is a bad word, don't you know? <laughs> no, I think the only reason why it's bad is I don't want somebody using it in a mean way. That's why we say gauge. You could cheat and just write Tris. I don't like cheating. You know, I would never cheat on my wife Shayla, who is also my cousin. <laughs> oh, I love Shayla. I love that bit so much. Me too, man. I cannot wait until I can edit down the 9 to 5 work streams. Because there's going to be some good bits in most of them. Okay, last name. If you want me to write your name, I gotta do is donate or use your channel points. Last name. we go the last call I'll give you guys 10 seconds
I will sing a song. <laughs> She's tired. <laughs> You're so- no. Kovobo's not mean. He's not mean. Bah. I'll find a song. sung in a long time. I gotta find the lyrics. I'm gonna do Oh Miss Believer by 21 and Pilots, one of their older songs. Y'all might not know it. If you could! Everybody put your favorite emotes in the chat. Also, here's a playlist of all my other singing clips on my YouTube channel. I think I'll do the first verse. Okay. I'm gonna turn the overhead light off because it's ugly. I never look good in white light. It makes me look really red. Like, I like this. I look a bit warmer. Okay. Ready? Oh, misbeliever, my pretty sleeper, your twisted mind is like snow on the road, your shaking shoulders prove that it's colder inside your head than the winter of death. With the muffs on your ears, will cater your fears. My nose and feet are running as we start to travel through snow. Together we go. A while since I've done that one. It's always so fun. It's another of the ones that you get to kind of like bolt when you sing. There we go. Thank you for redeeming. Thank you for stalling. <laughs> Bye, Mac. I'll see you Thursday. Guys, I'm gonna wrap it up here for today. Thank you for hanging out, everybody. Plan for this week. I should be able to stream Thursday and Friday. Hopefully, I'm busy tomorrow. And subathon is this Saturday, meaning every single gifted sub, tier one, and bit cheer extends how long I can stream for. Stream starts at 10 a.m. on Saturday. It has a 12 hour cap. So y'all can make me stream until 10 p.m. Wow. Okay. Before I go, make sure everybody you are subscribed to my YouTube channels. I have a main channel with weekly stream highlights and a clips channel with daily YouTube shorts and clips from stream. New video that was posted on Saturday is I beat the hardest level in Mario Odyssey. Very good video. Watch all of it. Leave a comment. Go like it, please. It actually did really well. Because I was going to title that video I can't stop playing until I beat darker side but not many people know a darker side so changing the title to i beat the hardest level in odyssey banger title channeling my inner ludwig okay i'll see you guys do my shoulder hurts so much it's not the vaccine the vaccine wasn't this arm this is just normal arm shit that hurts okay 
I'll see you guys tomorrow. No, not tomorrow, fuck. I'll see you guys Thursday. Okay, bye-bye. I'm Markiplier, bye-bye. Bye, Janoki, enjoy your gifted sub! My conspiracy is that Tanuki just watches the Mario Kart stream, so he gets a sub. Not even kidding. <laughs> Feel better? I'll be fine. Um, I'm just really tired. I could be dehydrated. I drank a whole cup of water today, on stream. Who got auto-modded? <laughs> you guys are so dumb. Kobobo said gay with two A's, and Max said gay. <laughs> Omega dance. I will not allow that blasphemy in my chant. I said it. <laughs> also, I don't know why the stream crashed earlier. I generally don't know why. Like, it worked perfectly fine yesterday. It probably could be the rain. Big L. I oh, don't know, we'll see. I'll see you guys on Thursday. I might do the work sim on Thursday or Friday. I still don't know. I, I'm leaning towards Friday for the work sim. So probably Spirit Fair on Thursday, guys. So if you need to catch up on Spirit Fair, watch the VODs. There's a tiny bit of lore. Go watch it. Okay. Bye-bye. Yeah, nobody's left, so no raid. Bye.